Hello everyone! Right now I am sitting on a bench and I am filming a video. In case you didn't know. Since it is 2015 now, I thought that I would do kind of like a video on 2014, just kind of like reviewing a lot of the products that I love and just could not get through 2014 without. I am doing, I don't know if this is a tag or not. Uh, I think it's just kind of like a video that people like do every year or whatever, I don't know, but I'm just gonna call it a tag and go with it. So I'm doing my top 14 products of 2014. Yeah, and I'm just going to talk about all of them and just kind of like give you guys my opinions and you know, everything like that. So let's just get right on into it. First off, I have two beauty products and I use these products so much. I use them every single day. They are just like my everyday products because I use them every day. Uh, <laughs> I just love these. The first one is this. It is called the Avino Clear Complexion BB Cream. Ooh, and it has sunscreen. I didn't even know it had sunscreen, but it does. You guys have seen this in so many videos. Basically all of my, well, yeah, all of my makeup tutorials I use this. This is the first step to my makeup routine. I just put it all over my face and kind of like rub it in and it just makes my skin tone kind of like more blended in, if you know what I mean. Like it blends your skin tone. I don't know how much this was because I've had it for a while. Like as you can tell, it's, it's like, it's not a big jar, but since you only use a little bit every day, it like it lasts you forever so I've been using this the whole year of 2014 from the start to the finish I love this stuff so much and I definitely recommend it I don't know where I got it from probably just like the drugstore or something but I love this stuff and it's just amazing I love it next I have this item and this is also like a face product kind of thing and it's another BB cream I use two BB creams I don't know if that's weird but I like how it looks so I mean whatever it is called the Shiseido BB cream and you guys have seen this one like all the time too and it has SPF 35 and I think the other one was like SPF 30 Boom. Next I want to talk to you guys about a few fashion favorites which are my favorite type of favorites The first one is These shoes. These are ugh, Hold on. These are pink high top converse and I love converse if you guys didn't know I have white black and pink but I really want to get some more colors and I, I just love these so much like they are so easy to put on and you can wear them with like whatever you want like I can wear these with dresses I can wear these with shorts jeans leggings whatever I want to wear them with I can do it and it won't look weird and these are only $25 which is amazing I found them at like Ross so I didn't even pay full price for them <laughs> if they had them in every color I swear I would have bought in every single color because I honestly love these and I have like a little collection going on and I hope to you know, get that collection going a little better in 2015 and, you know, Converse collection, boom boom, 2015, let's go. Next, I have been absolutely loving, like, these flowy shorts and flowy pants and I just love them so much. They are so comfy, so much comfier than jeans. Let me tell you, they are just like wearing pajamas, but, like, fancy pajamas. My mom likes to call them her fancy pants, or no, her fun pants. She likes to call them her fun pants and let me tell you, they are fun and they are pants or shorts, either one. These ones I got from Aeropostale and they are just this like floral print. I think I'll show these in my June favorites, but I love these things so much. They are amazing, they're so comfy, and I just like to wear them with like a plain white tank top or a black shirt or something like that just to bring out the white and the black in the bottom. They are a cute way to dress up any outfit without being uncomfortable because comfiness is key. The next thing is lace dresses. I love dresses and I've been really getting into lace ones this year. This one is just a blue, I don't know if you can see it all, this one's just like a blue lacy one and I wore this to a wedding that I went to in Chicago. It's from Francesca so if you guys are wondering it has kind of like a low back which I think is really cute as well and it was only like $30, $40, something like that so it's not bad at all. I think it has a cool cut to it and you can just do a lot of things with lace dresses. They're just so girly and so cute and so comfy. So that's why I like them. Next, scarves. I love scarves so much. This one I actually just got for Christmas from Cynthia and I love it. It's just like a gray infinity scarf and it is so cute and oh my god I think it's got hair on my lip. Ew. It's really soft and I just love wearing scarves. Obviously not in the summertime because it's too hot, but like in the winter and the fall time I love wearing them because they're just so easy. They're like a 
They're like a, like a warm necklace, warm and soft necklace. Well, they're not, I don't even know what I'm saying. You guys know what I mean, right? Right? I don't know. Next. Overalls! I love overalls so much. This is my only pair right now, but I really want to get like a long pair, like the pant ones. This one is from Kohl's. I love this one so much. It was only like $20, and it is amazing. Like, it literally is perfection. Oh my god, I sound so weird right now. I just have so much energy. I had a half day of school today, and I'm just like, woo! -hoo! So yeah, I'm just, I have a lot of energy right now, so I thought I would film because, I mean, I like having energy when I film. Anyways, <laughs> I'm going off topic. So back to the overalls. I love these things so much. They are amazing, and I love wearing like crop tops under them, or honestly, you can wear whatever you want under them. Some people may not like them, and I can see why. They're very like, out there, I guess. That is definitely my style. I love doing crazy things with my style and just trying a lot of new things. So I tried some overalls and I ended up really liking them. And the last fashion piece I have is, of course, crop tops. I love me some crop tops and I love wearing them with my overalls, like I just said. So this one I actually did wear with my overalls in Chicago one day and I just love that outfit so much. I wanna wear it again and I can't wait until summer so I can wear it again. This one is from Aeropostale. And it's just like a floral one. I think it's really pretty and the colors are very like springy. It puts me in a good mood and I love wearing this because I'm just like, yes. So next I have my random favorites and the first one is this. I love this. Besides chocolate milk, which you guys all know, my chocolate milk and I are just like one. I've been really getting into the Keurig drink things. This one is from Grove Square and it is called the Caramel Cappuccino. I actually had a caramel frappe this morning, a frappe, not like a cappuccino, from Starbucks and it was really good but I don't know. I don't know which one I like better. I, I don't know if I like this one better or the Starbucks one better but these ones are a lot less expensive, obviously. I also have the milk chocolate one but I don't have any to show you guys because I kind of drank them all and this was the last one that I could find in this one so right after this video I'm gonna go and make some because I just... I'm in the mood. My friend's FaceTiming me. Okay, moving on. So I have these makeup wipes right here, which are amazing. They are called the... They're by Neutrogena. They're, they're just called makeup remover towelette things. I love these. These get off my makeup so easily. And I know like some makeup wipes, it feels like I'm like ripping off my eyelashes because you have to like, you know, get the mascara off. But these ones are so gentle and it just, it doesn't feel like I'm even touching my eyelashes to be honest. Like I don't feel it at all. Okay, so I have a favorite movie of 2014. It came out a little later in 2014. It was like maybe September... I think, or October, I don't even know, but it is The Rainer, Runner, Rainer, did I just say Rainer? The Runner of the Maze, aka The Maze Runner with um, Dylan O'Brien on the front, and I just love this movie, I cannot wait for the Scorch Trials, I'm just so excited, and I think it's coming out, it's coming out this sometime this year, like late this year, I think, I don't know, I retweeted a picture on my Twitter with like, the movies and the Scorch, the Scorch Trials. Scorch Trials was like later in the year. I don't know. I, I forget the exact day, but you can go like look at my Twitter if you want. I actually got to go with my school because they did this kind of cool thing where if you did the summer reading project, which was on the Maze Runner, then you got to go to the movie. So of course I did it because I wanted to go see my baby. So um, yeah, but I just really love this movie. And uh, once all the movies come out, I'm going to buy them all. And then I'm going to invite my friends over. We're going to have a Maze Runner marathon. Oh my god, that makes so much sense because it's a runner and marathons are like running and M and maze and marathon. Oh, it's just so great. And my last favorite for 2014, that's not like a song because I do have a few like song favorites, but I didn't include those in 14 just because I have a few of them and it just... Anyway, they are my Turby Twist things and these are amazing. These saved my life because I don't know about you guys, but... I shower every morning because I just get like so tired and showers just help wake me up. Plus my hair doesn't look good if I don't take a shower because like then it, like it just, um, 
it's a long story. It's a long process, okay? This hair is a long process. You put your hair up in them after, and then it just keeps your hair out of your face, so I can do, I can wash my face, I can put my contacts in, brush my teeth without my hair getting in the way, and it's just so great. And it also dries it as well, so once I get to like the blow drying part of my routine, then it's already like halfway dry, which is amazing. So it takes time out of blow drying, so it allows more time to sleep, which is great. So I love these. So now I'm gonna show you guys some things that I love, like music and that kind of stuff. So I have a few music favorites. The first one is All About It. I also really like I want to show you guys my favorite song ever because I don't think I've ever mentioned it before. So this is it. It's called Albi and it's just a really cool song and I really like it. It's like a slower song, you know. Shake It Off by Taylor Swift. Take Me to Church. My lover's got humor. She's a giggle at a funeral. Wobble. songs and I think that concludes this video so these products and songs are basically 2014 summed up for me I love these and I also went on a lot of cool trips like I went to all right this was like a crazy part of 2014 probably the craziest part of 2014 so my friend invited me to a house that they rented at the beach so I went to go stay with her for a few days and then I came home it was from I think it was from like uh, Sunday to Wednesday. I came home Wednesday night. I had like 10 volleyball games and then the next day I woke up early and I went to Chicago for a week. And can I just say that was crazy but I loved it. It was so fun. And I actually went to Chicago for a wedding which was my very first wedding that I attended that I remember. I don't know if I went to any before. I don't think I did. It was a lot of fun and I have a video on that below if you guys want to see it. It's called Wedding Wearables something something outfit ideas. I don't know. And I also got to walk around Chicago a little because I love that city. I also went to Disney and spent a week there. I think it was a week there or something. And I have a Florida Fashion Festivities on that. Basically, whenever I go travel somewhere, I make a video out of it because I love filming in different places because I think it's really fun. I'm kind of just rambling on right now, but I just wanted to kind of do like a recap on 2014 just to like say goodbye to the old year and say hello to the new year. And I hope 2015 is a great year. I feel like it's going to be because all of my years just get better and better. And I hope it's good for you guys as well. Okay, that was a lot of talking. I'm sorry. I apologize. But anyways, I really hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And leave me any video requests below, as always, if you guys want to. And I love you guys so much. Let's make 2015. A good year. Yeah, I'm gonna go now because I have to go study for finals. Which I should be doing right now, but I decided to make a video instead because, um, I wanna do. Yeah. See ya! <laughs>